The guy who rose to fame at an early age of 12 and made it big in the Hollywood music scene is a force to be reckoned with, don't you think? Despite his many downfalls and obstacles, this Canadian superstar is back with a bang with his recent album, which has scored a million bucks, by the way. If you've watched Seasons, then sit tight for this one as well, because the Muse family brings you an exclusive season all on your favorite star, Justin Bieber. Hey guys, welcome again to the Muse family, your most loved channel on YouTube for all celeb scoops. <laughs> It's Wednesday, and I'm back with the third episode of the Justin Bieber series. Now, in case you haven't checked out the first two, well, then drop everything else and check it out right now before you watch today's episode. In this series, I'll bring to you exclusive facts on Justin Bieber filled with all the interesting and crazy stories of the singer's journey to date. Not to forget the snippets of interviews from the singer himself. Now, before I begin with today's episode, you know the drill, fam. Hit that bell icon so that you never miss out on any updates from the Muse. Also, did you guys know that your favorite Muse family is a live online store? From cool graphic t-shirts to funky caps, you'll find it all over here. So what are you waiting for? Grab yours now. In the last episode, you have seen a never-ending list of Justin's lovers, but all of them were passing clouds because enter Haley. Did you know that Justin and Haley eloped and got married in secret? Sure, they had a formal reception later on, but at first it was just all about the drama. I'll be decoding their fairy tale romance just for you guys, but it's not all about roses and chocolates. Watch out for the top two moments when Justin Bieber, the celebrated global icon, lost his head on national television and Bieber's epic transformation from a sex addict, alcoholic superstar to a sober husband. Whoa! But to find out all about it, you'd better watch this episode till the end. Beginning of a fairy tale. Imagine you went for a meet and greet with your favorite pop star, and a few years later, bam, you get married to him. Sounds like a Taylor Swift music video, right? Well, that's exactly what happened to lucky girl Haley Baldwin. In news that will make you feel very old, Justin and Haley first met in 2009 when the then 12-year-old Haley was introduced to the baby singer by her famous father, Stephen, backstage at the Today Show. The two of them were just kids back then, and for Haley, it was nothing more than a fangirl moment. Little did she know what was going to happen next. They bumped into each other again in 2011 at the premiere of Bieber's Never Say Never movie, but by this point, he was dating Selena Gomez. Nevertheless, he and Haley remained good friends. Haley explained herself the couple gave things another go after bumping into each other at a church conference. She said, We ended up being at this church conference together in Miami, and it was the first time we'd seen each other in a while. In the summer of 2015, Justin and Haley got matching G tattoos. You know what that means, right, fam? And that's not all. Haley was one of the first girls who actually went on vacation with Justin's family. Whoa! Meeting the parents. Now that's a big step. Throughout the tropical vacation, Justin posted a flurry of photos with Haley, his father, and his siblings, including one fan favorite video of Justin teasing Haley while she poses for the camera. Going official. Justin and Haley kinda sorta confirmed their relationship in separate interviews after ringing in 2016 together. In an interview with GQ, Justin said that Haley is someone who he really loves, but also said he didn't want to commit to anything. Ah, oh, the famous commitment phobia. In fact, Justin was asked the same thing on The Ellen DeGeneres Show. He was asked if he had commitment issues or not. And to everyone's surprise, he actually did. In fact, Justin Bieber has said this not once, not twice, but multiple times. So how come things worked out with Haley? Let's see. Keeping in line with all of this, Haley too made a groundbreaking comment. Haley also confirmed that she and Justin were dating, but not official, around the same time. We are not an exclusive couple. Right. From open relationships to masters and PDA, Bieber and Baldwin did it all. Throughout the month of June, Justin and Haley embarked on a public, unconfirmed relationship tour unlike any other. They cuddled in a club, they kissed in Domino Park, they directed traffic in the Hamptons, and, of course, they went to church together. 
After popping the question, Justin and Haley literally got married in an almost secret ceremony in the courthouse in 2018. Do you know why? Because Haley's parents did not approve of the relationship at all. Citing anonymous inside sources, people reported that the couple was officially married in the courthouse. They went ahead and did it without listening to anyone, a source told People. No wonder the parents were mad. Would yours be mad if you did something like this? <laughs> Share your funniest answers in the comment section below and I'll tag the best one. According to the outlet, a religious source also confirmed that Justin and Haley are now legally married. Haley, however, took to Twitter shortly after the news broke and denied the reports. I understand where the speculation is coming from, but I'm not married yet. She later deleted the tweet. Hmm, I wonder why? After going on and off, getting married in secret, and later having an official reception, Justin and Haley still didn't quite feel married. Now, being the Instagram couple that they are, things got official for the first time when they confirmed it all on social media. Phew! Justin shared a candid shot with Haley using a simple caption, My wife is awesome. According to Elle, that wasn't originally the caption of his photo. Fans took to the post as an official confirmation on the couple's relationship status. The model, formerly known as Haley Baldwin, now apparently goes by Haley Road Bieber, Road being her middle name, and the rest, as you guys know, is history. It's been two years since their marriage, but things are starting to unravel just a bit. Recently, Justin was spotted thrashing a car door on Haley. Whoa! Where did all that love go? Are they on the verge of breaking up, guys? Is Justin not happy with Haley anymore? Were Haley's parents right when they asked the couple not to get married so young? So many questions, but the answers will be coming in the next episode, fam. And now that all the rosy stuff is done with, let's dive right into some of that crazy stuff that the pop star has done. After all, what's the point of sitting through a Justin Bieber series if you don't go all shocked and surprised by this craziness? Top 2 Moments When Justin Bieber Went Crazy On National Television Number 1. Peeing In A Restaurant Bucket Drunk Oh my gosh, you may or may not have heard it before, but here we go again. The clip was shot in New York City during Bieber's early days. Bieber and his friends were leaving some nightclub, exiting through a restaurant kitchen, and Bieber decided he needed to take a leak. But rather go to the bathroom like a civilized person? Bieber, wearing pants that should literally be illegal, whizzed into a yellow mop bucket used to clean the restaurant's floor, meaning whoever's job it was to mop the place up had to physically change Bieber's disgusting piss water. And the worst part? Bieber's friends acted like the restaurant should be honored that the singer decided to piss there. It's revolting. I can't say for sure if the group was drunk, but it sounds like they were. Oh yeah, at the end of the video, Bieber sprays a photo of Bill Clinton with cleaning liquid for some reason, hurling an abuse. What have you got against Clinton, Justin? Number 2. Accused of lip syncing in a concert when it comes to music, no one can say anything against Justin, but this tradition got a break on his Global Purpose Tour. In his concert in India, Justin was accused of lip-syncing his songs. Can you believe that? Believers, who had shelled out thousands of rupees to listen to Justin Bieber, said that they were appalled when they realized that the teen pop sensation was lip-syncing some of his songs at his much-awaited concert in Mumbai. The 23-year-old singer, who was in India as part of the Asia leg of his Purpose World Tour, is believed to have left the country after this. Even though there's no solid proof of such, still it hurts to imagine, doesn't it, fam? These are just drops in the bucket. Justin Bieber has done even more crazy stuff that will blow your mind. There are so many instances when Justin Bieber went gaga and punched reporters and behaved aggressively with women. Also, when he was asked in an interview about doing drugs, he admitted to such scary stories that will keep you up at night. But hey, you didn't think I would say all of this just today, did you? So keep an eye out for my next episode of the Justin Bieber series next Wednesday, only on The Muse Family. And if you've liked today's video, then drop those likes and shares right away, fam. I'll see you next week. Till then, stay hooked to The Muse Family. Bye-bye.